I thought with Halloween coming up, people might want a video about more creepy gas masks they could uh, get for Halloween. So this isn't really a top 10 sort of creepy list because I've already done, you know, videos like that. But I thought what would be good is just to do a video with some masks that you might be able to get fairly cheap as surplus. Then you could come up with your own costume ideas and combine them. So most of the masks are actually going to end up being Soviet or Warsaw pack masks really in this video. This one being the Soviet PMG, which is the Metrocop mask from Half-Life 2. Or the closest mask you can get to the Metrocop mask. But let's look at some other ones as well. So most of these masks you should be able to get on eBay fairly cheaply. If you want something really retro looking, uh, the French ANPM 51 gas mask could do the job. There's both Belgium and French versions of this mask and a few other very similar looking masks. You can normally get these very cheap as surplus masks, a lot of them are in quite bad condition. Um, obviously you can wear it with a choice of filters, just make sure you're wearing it with a sil safe filter if you want to use it as a filter, or you could attach a hose to it, whichever you prefer. So here's the mask without the filter on, probably can't hear me very well, but I like that the mask has a good retro look to it. But obviously what I could do now is attach a hose to this mask, so a Soviet hose probably will screw in all right. There you go, so you could um, attach the mask to a hose and then what you could do is use that hose and just hide it somewhere in your costume uh, so it looks like you've got it obviously connected to a uh, sort of thing that way. I think that would look good for sort of a Halloween mask that you could get on the cheap, very very cheap. So another good one is the Polish MUA mask. Uh, this is like the Polish version of the um, PMG2, whatever. It's basically the Polish OM14, which is their version of the SHM41, with a little voice diaphragm on the nose. I think it looks quite skull-like, uh, so that would make it a good mask, I think, for um, you know a Halloween type thing. But there you go. Again, it's. Uh, because it's a Warsaw pack mask, do not use the filters these come with. You could just use a hose, tuck the hose in to a part of your costume if you had some sort of boiler suit or big coat on. And then obviously just breathe fresh air through the hose connected to the mask. Here we have the SHMS. Because uh, I haven't got the filter on, it's making all the grunting noises, but I think that might you know, add to the effect if you wore this somewhere and your voice is all distorted and weird like that when you talk to people. Again, the same rules apply, don't use the filter, just probably attach it to a hose and then hide the hose into the costume, but there you go, SHM41 I think would be a very good Halloween mask. And I think another one, good one would be the uh, Russian or Soviet PDF children's mask. There's quite a few of these available in different variants, I think any of them would do in any colour. I think what would make these look quite creepy is the fact that they're simply just too small for an adult. So if I put it on somehow. Definitely not the most comfortable mask. But I think that might, might look a bit creepy just simply because it's too small for an adult. You probably want to try and get the largest child size PDF you can to make it more comfortable for an adult to wear but I personally think that this probably looks quite creepy if you had it as part of a Halloween costume you could just leave that dangling like that and you sort of turn your head so there you go that's my um, list of creepy gas masks that you could probably wear for Halloween and get on the cheap obviously I've not included a GP5 but you could do that but please please don't use the filters